Hi guys, you might be wondering why I look like a demon and it's because I just got back from hell and by hell I mean soul cycle. No, it's not that bad. I like it like in Like a masochist kind of way You know usually the golden hour makes me look better, but this is just making it worse I've been wanting to do another diet and exercise video and I wasn't really sure who to do it on like what celebrity or what brand or like keto I started soul cycling like a week ago and then I was in, well not soul cycle, it's at LA Fitness, whatever. So I started spin classes last week and I was, and I still can't breathe. <clears throat> As I was spinning my soul today, I was thinking, I was like, like what just inspired me to do this? And I realized that Emma Chamberlain, like I watch her and she spins like every single day of her life. So was like, why not start spinning? Basically, I am go- I also, like, the oxygen hasn't gone back to my brain yet. My- ow. This is all just a long-winded way of saying that I'm gonna be doing Emma Chamberlain's diet and exercise. <laughs> like, okay, so coffee, obviously, and then healthy, but like she also allows herself to eat unhealthy food. Otherwise, it's harder to stick to a diet anyways if you, like, restrict yourself completely. And plus, I just want to be able to enjoy the food that I like. And plus, if you're spinning every single day, or at least working out every single day, you're going to be okay. I'm going to research more strictly Emma Chamberlain's diet tonight. Like, not that she has a strict diet. Like, I'm going to find out more about how she eats and exercises. Today, I literally had coffee, a fruit smoothie, a salad chicken and i'm about to go have my mom's like seafood salad dish this is too much information i Ooh. hi guys so i'm gonna show you a little bit of this workout it's probably an uncomfortable position for you this mat still has sand on it from the beach because sometimes i'll randomly just go do like beach yoga emma hasn't actually uploaded a video on her workout since 2017 um, but we know that she spins like every single day, which I've been spinning every day. So I've been spinning as much as I can, and in days where I can't, I'm just been going for a run or doing these workouts instead. Her workout routine is already pretty similar to what I do. Like if you watch her 2017 video, she talks about like the arm press machines and like the leg closing machines, and she has 20 minutes of cardio. I'm going to be showing you her floor workouts other than the machines. So. Day three, I, I didn't go to spin today because I woke up for the sunrise and then I went to LBI and I did surf though. So I did get a pretty good workout and we're on day six and I just had a salad. It's really nice outside today, so I'm gonna go for a run rather than cycling, which is kind of like standing up cycling, kind of. So, something that I forgot about when I decided to do this video is that Emma Chamberlain is a vegan. Turns out she's not a vegetarian, I mean, she's not a vegan. She is a vegetarian and she just tries to eat as vegan as possible. I mean, that's not too far off from how I am in my life. Like, I try not to eat too much dairy. Every once in a while, I go through a cheese addiction. I try not to eat a lot of red meat to start with. So, if I'm, that means I'm pretty much just cutting out chicken, which, like, chicken and cheese are my two favorite foods. But I can survive this. I feel a lot better. 
So I'm taking my dog out to pee right now. Hey guys, I'm breaking out. I went to spin with makeup on. Not right now, like last week. Also, I think that for this challenge, I haven't been drinking enough iced coffee and I thought my heart rate is already super high. Why not make it higher? So this isn't from Phil's obviously because I don't live in Los Angeles, but it is from Wawa. It's the mocha mint and it's so good. I just dropped Shelby off from a concert we went we were at went to and I was like in her freezer and I wanted ice cream and I was like, where do you get this ice cream? And she was like, you can just have that one. So I have some vegan, like non-dairy ice cream. I'm gonna eat it and I'm gonna enjoy myself. Got a little workout at the concert because it's reggae. When you go get the and this is literally all you do. I waitressed all day and then I worked out and then I went to spit class, did some arm. <laughs> The fam had tomatoes and basil and peppers and onions for dinner and steak. Um, no, that's not steak juice, that's tomato juice. So I need to find something else to eat besides this, but this is what I'm eating. Shelby is helping me avoid meat, and to do that, we're making pasta. This looks threatening without context. Tia's dog keeps licking the back of my knees. I probably smell like garlic. Maybe she's Italian. Wait, who likes garlic? Is that like Transylvanians? No, they're like the vampires. So they don't like garlic. Yeah, they don't like garlic. But like the people who aren't vampires in Transylvania. Is Transylvania real? Romania. Italians like garlic. Why do I not know that? I studied abroad, did you know that? Watch our video about every single girl who studies abroad. You see this Y right here? That's for Yeezy. You didn't look. It looks like a P. It looks like a P? Oh, a P. How does it look like a P? Yeah, but it's not connected here. It's a little rounded. I feel like I'm dying. How do they do this so effortlessly at work? I'm ready for pasta. Literally it kind of looks cool headless. Mm -hmm. This is reminding me of that meme where the girl's like, talk about it, talk about it. We should definitely eat something while we prepare the thing that we're gonna eat. Okay, so. Here's the vegetarian buffalo chicken. Oh my god, Nick's a freaking sociopath. He literally had me make him ramen last night, and all he wanted was just butter and pepper. My pasta's ready. So I'm about halfway through, and I've been making some good progress. Like, this is definitely an improvement since earlier this summer when I was all pasta filled from Italy. Why is there just a pair of pants there? My head just looks like a very pale toe. I'm going to go work out and then I'm driving straight to this place Uncle Dude's which is this uh, donut shop in the town next to me that's just like really well known and super good and they have really weird donuts and I'll show you mostly because I deserve it. Jesus I'm on my way now, um, looking like a demon again. So I was trying to decide if I'm gonna get the four donut box or the nine. And like, cause I probably within the next couple days will eat four, but like my family wants them too. So I'll get nine, but they're probably- In 1000 feet. Slight right. Okay, slight right. I mean, I know I'm gonna end up getting the box of nine, if you could smell this right now, I'm wafting. Oh my goodness, this is so good. I don't know which one I wanna eat right now. This is called Vermont Swine. It's bacon and maple and it's so good. Um, right now I'm enjoying a smoothie from Pliables. This one's called the Booster and it has a lot of protein in it since I haven't been eating meat. I've been feeling really tired and weak actually. So, cause like I just haven't been replacing it properly. This has protein in it. 
vegan chocolate protein and peanut butter and also has spirulina it's pretty good so i'm on my way to my spin class obviously that's what this entire video is about the real workout is walking to la from the opposite side of this huge plaza and i finished this diet tomorrow oh but i might actually stick to it emma if you're watching this which you're not th thanks for inspiring me to change my diet and exercise i actually feel so good i'm bloated right now but the past few weeks i have actually felt so much better i lost a lot of weight i actually don't know what i weigh right now i i don't like weigh myself frequently because i think it's dumb to base like to base your health off of specifically how much you weigh sometimes in certain situations you need to weigh yourself um but i feel like i've lost weight i look like i've lost weight and i just feel overall better so I don't think it's necessary to keep close track on my weight. Hey everyone, so I actually filmed that video back in July, August. Um, it's December 21st or 2nd right now, so I just got busy during the semester and didn't have time to edit it, but I'm gonna be doing more videos um, over winter break and hopefully I'll have time next semester. But I just wanted to show you my final results. So. Here is what I started off with in the summer. I was not comfortable with it because it, I had never been that heavy before. I was just like, when I was in Italy, I didn't care that I was gaining weight because I was like, whatever, like I'm having fun. I don't care. Like I still feel like I look good. And I got back and I was like, I don't look bad, but like I want to be in that like super fit shape again. So I stuck to it. I did this Emma Chamberlain diet. By the end of the summer, I looked like this and I feel like I was in one of my best shapes and yeah so here's a few before and after pictures. excited that I'm finally going to be uploading this. I hope this helps you in some way and thank you for watching my video.